says very clearly that it is not building a nuclear bomb. Um, it says that it's never done any research into building uh, a nuclear bomb. It says that all of its nuclear activities uh, are directed towards purely peaceful purposes. The trouble is that it's, it's you know, not many people in the international community believe Iran. They do believe, uh, and there's evidence to suggest that in the past they may have conducted some research uh, which would be relevant to making a nuclear bomb. What we know is that it, it certainly doesn't have a nuclear weapon. I mean, that, that's one thing that, to make absolutely clear. What it does have is the ability to enrich uranium. Uh, uranium is the substance which is needed to uh, fuel nuclear reactors. Uh, and if you enrich it even more, it's the substance that you need to create a nuclear bomb. Uh, Iran has been enriching this uranium for years now, as it has every right to do, because it's a, uh, a member of the uh, Nuclear Non-Proliferation Treaty. It's allowed under that treaty to enrich uranium. Uh, but the trouble is, in the past, it's not disclosed some of its activities to the international community. And that's why there's such a lack of trust with Iran at the moment. Well, the IAEA is the UN's nuclear watchdog agency. It's the independent body which has you know, a whole range of nations that are members, including Iran, uh, that inspects nuclear facilities, not just in Iran, but all over the world. There are a lot of questions that the IAEA has that Iran has not answered. Uh, for instance, uh, it wants access, the UN does, uh, to, su to suspicious nuclear sites that it suspects uh, may have been uh, the location where nuclear weapons testing uh, uh, may have been carried out or development for those weapons may have been carried out and so there are lots of areas, lots of gaps in Iran's story uh, that it, it, it has yet to fill out. The United Nations Security Council has sanctions in place against Iran. The United States has very tough sanctions in place as well. Most recently the European Union uh, said that none of its companies would be permitted to import oil from Iran. So. Um, those sanctions striking at the heart of Iran's economy. It's one of the biggest oil producers in the world. So far though, none of these sanctions have had the desired effect, uh, which would be to get Iran to end its, its nuclear activities or to open up its, its nuclear activities to, to further inspection. Instead, Iran says uh, that it's gonna press ahead with them. It's being defiant in the face of these, these sanctions.